Carlos, were you surprised with the way FC Goa approached this match? No, no surprise. I was sure that they were studying our system and we tried to change some little things to try to surprise them. And I think that it was working. I think that we create a lot of uh, counter-attacks that only we were missing the last pass to, to really create the chance of goal. So I'm quite happy with the, with the match plan. I think it was working for us. Did Bengaluru FC become complacent after leading by one goal at the early stage of the game? Is defence a concern for BFC going into the next game? Of course not. No complaints. Of course not. My players were fighting for the three points and it's what they were uh, wishing from the first minute. The thing is that uh, we are in, in precision yet because it has been a short uh, precision for all of us and they have been giving their best. I think that there was one moment that we start to suffer and uh, we try to make the, the substitutions uh, before that they get the two goals, but that thing happens. Eh? They also have a, a very good team, a lot of quality players players and these kind of things happen. After giving up a two-goal lead, what will you tell your team? Was bringing on Rahul Beke something you will reflect on? Yeah, we know Raul Beke is a player of the national team. We know that he is very good in defence. So I was thinking that maybe uh, we need to give some uh, new breath to the defence, you know, because Ashik was doing a fantastic job, but it was a defender of uh, three players only. So we put Raúl, you know, to try to to keep the result, and Ashik was uh, trying to make some impact in attack. So I think that uh, you know, it's football; that kind of things happen. We do uh, a good match plan, and things were going on, and well, we get a point. I think that uh, uh, before the game, eh, we, we were expecting a nice game, and it was like this: four goals, good show. That the team was holding on to a draw, draw rather than looking for a win after the 60 minute mark. <laughs> of course not, of course not. We're doing substitutions, we were putting offensive players, we tried to keep more the ball, eh? putting Dimas in the pitch, and, and yeah, we try until the end, eh? putting Leon, eh? another uh, striker, another forward, trying to surprise them with the speed of the players. So, no, we were going for the three points, but we have to understand the moment of the season that we are now. Last question, what are your first impressions of this unique season in terms of the playing conditions, player fitness and synchronization between players? I think that we are watching that in all the games. Eh? It's it's been hard for the players. It's been tough because uh, it has been only a few weeks of preseason, and that's normal. It's normal. It's not an excuse. We all have to work on that. And fortunately, I think that there is no injuries today. Uh, last two games, it, it it was something happening with players. So we have to try to preserve the health of the players. Thank you, Carlos. Thank you. Thank you so much, Carlos. See you.